Hi guys and welcome to this tutorial on how to attach and scale an image based on a reference line. In a previous tutorial I showed you how to scale an image based on some coordinates, but if you're not able to place some coordinates if you're using a website where you're not able to place the coordinates or where they're using another coordinate system compared to the coordinate system that you use in uh, AutoCAD, in such a case you can use a reference line in order to scale the image. But if I open Google Maps, in this case I have a reference line which we can see in the bottom left corner and I can use this uh, reference line in order to scale the image but first I just want to turn off all of the street names and I can do this if I, if I click here and then remove the labels and now I just want to get a an image of this area right here so I can go to the start menu and then I can select the clipping tool and now I just want to mark the area that I want of the image and I want to save it and if I open AutoCAD then first I just want to unload the image that I have already attached and I can do this if I select the image and then right click and then say unload and then to attach the image that I have just uh, downloaded from Google Maps I can just click within this area or right click and then I will select attach image and now I just want to select the image and click on open and in this case we want to uh, specify on screen so just click OK and I can just place it somewhere near the project area and if I zoom in then we have the reference that we know that the distance from this point to here should be 200 meters. So now I want to type in L for line and then I want to draw a line for this point and this line should represent 200 meters but I also want to draw another line so again type in L for line and this line I want to have a length of uh, 200 meters and hit enter and the next step is to type in a line and then hit enter and now we want to select the image and hit enter and we want to specify the first point which will be the starting point of the short line and the starting point should have a reference to the starting point of the line with a length of 200 meters so we'll do the same with the endpoint. So click at the endpoint and again at the endpoint of the line which has a length of 200 meters. So now just hit enter and now we want to type in Y because we want to scale the image. So type in Y and hit enter. And now we can see that this line which has a length of 200 meters fit with the image that we have and then the next step is to move the image so it fits with the location of our technical map but first I just want to move the image to the background and I can do this if I select the image and then right click and then I will select um, draw order and I want to send the image to the back and now I want to move the image so I need some kind of uh, reference point and the reference point could be, for example, we have the technical map and then we have the, the edge of the road where we have this corner. So this point could be the reference point and I have the same point in the image. So if I select the image and then type in M for move and when my cursor is placed more or less at the edge of the road, I will just click and now I just want to move it to the technical map which I can snap to and when I zoom out then we can see that the technical map and the image more or less uh, fits together 